ladies, gentlemen, and all variations thereupon and thereof, I am Odralix, and today I welcome you back to To The Moon. Now, when we last left off, these children were about to show us around the house. However, there seems to be a cat. Let's see what that is. I think we just need a little convincing, that's all. What do you think, Tommy? Yeah! Alright. Let's talk. What do you punks want? We want... One trillion dollars! Or the candy cane mom hides from us. Should be simple enough. Yeah! Or that! Well, that's a, that's a lot easier to do. There is a giant candy cane on top of a high shelf that we can't reach. It's in the kitchen. Ma put it there to save for when we do chores. Get it for us, and we'll give you a tour through the house. What do you say? What's that? Was that a propeller in the window, or was that just a weird text thing? I don't know. What do you say? Well... Hmm... What the hell, let's go for side questing. You're lucky I don't want to walk up the stairs again, or I'd just tell your mother. The kitchen door is right next to the stairs. Now go! It's almost like some kind of a terrible quest to get my night started. Yeah. Sorry, Dr. Watts. This is, uh, what you gotta do. There's that candy cane. <laughs> I can't reach it. Uh, okay, get, get the table. Wow, okay. You swung that around like it was nothing. Received candy cane. Booyah! It's like taking candy from an inanimate baby. I really like the humor in this game. Yes, it's dry, but I absolutely love it. Alright. Frickin' Naughty kids. Alright, kiddos! That was a lot of odds back there, but I got the candy cane. It's probably a decade old and tastes like rubber, but you can use it like a walking stick. <laughs> Just look at you judgingly. <laughs> Alright, where do we start? I know, there's this funny room in the basement. I don't know about you guys, but funny room in the basement does not sound like a good thing to have. I don't like that funny room. And it just keeps getting worse! Where's this a fucking dungeon? Uh, what kind of funny room? That's what I'm wondering too, Dr. Watts. You'll see. That's not ominous at all. It's weird. I got that much. We need the keys, though. The old man hid it inside a book in the study. That seems like a lot of trouble to make sure you don't get into his funny room. C could we just not do that? No? Fine. And you're above your following me now. Great. Great. Nothing like being followed. This is the book room. Alright. The key to the funny room is in the thickest bu book on the upper shelf. Why do you know this so much? Like... Dusklight, the tale of a girl who fell in love with a zombie who emitted the smell of daisies when showered with yentles. 
cook with gentle sunlight. Is that? Yep, that's a that's a Twilight reference. <laughs> oh God, read it. <coughs> Maybe next time. Okay, he doesn't even. Oh God. The man sure knows where to hide things. Fucking kids. All right, what do you want me to do now? Tommy used to throw books at me and call it a book fight. Well, I'm not gonna read too much into that one. I'm terrible. Can, can we go now? Oh, what is this? Never mind. We go now. We can open the funny room in the basement now. I don't like the sound of a funny room still. This is the basement. We play hide and seek here. With the terrible monstrosities that are surely in this house. Nah, it's not that kind of RPG, I think. Turn on the light plate drip over something. Their voices keep changing and I'm sorry, but I cannot keep a consistent voice for the, lo uh, for the life of me. I also can't speak! There's a light. There's some kid- Bye, kids! That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> okay, they follow. You know what? I- mm, I don't know why I'm controlling with the arrow keys. It just doesn't work. Um... Or it's harder, at least. Ooh, chest! You should always open chests. Aww. What a boring chest. Okay, fine, we'll just open the room now. I'll stop stalling. The door is locked. No, really, is it? Open the door with the room. Alright. I do- It's like a cave in here! This just oozes of terrible things, but I don't think it will be? But it's just- I don't- I don't like- Never mind, it's totally that type of game. This is not creepy at all. It's just thousands of paper bunnies and a platypus for some reason. Rabbit folded up out of paper. Yeah. Uh, I can I can see that. Hey, what is that? Is that a photograph in the back, or is that just a candle or something? That thing, right there. I don't know. I'm gonna check the platypus. Stuffed toy platypus. What a hideous little creature. Wow! Whoa! <laughs> I don't wanna do either of those things! Okay, poke it. Okay, it fell down. How about... Oh, I pressed escape, but never mind. We now have the toy platypus. I don't think we wanted to do that. Did you see it? What do you kids know about all those rabbits? There is nothing more nefarious than rabbits. Have you watched Monty Python's The Holy Grail? Fear the rabbit. Nothing! You know nothing! How nice, Tommy! The old man didn't want anyone to go inside, so we never told him. I'm sure she had a good reason for that. There are more of them, actually. Where? Inside the abandoned lighthouse. Go there. It's just beneath this cliff. I've seen it. Wanna go see? I got the keys. Why do you have the keys to the lighthouse? That's dangerous. Let me guess. You aren't supposed to go in there either. As I said. <laughs> These kids are a hassle. How does that how how does Lily manage? Remind me to never keep any locked cabinets around you two. So you wanna go see the lighthouse? Well, it's rather windy outside, but Decision? 
Uh, mm, I kind of want to go see the lighthouse. Oh, to hack with it. I'm Dr. Watts. Mere wind can't stop me. But a lot of other things can. Like a tree and a squirrel and... Uh, come on, let's go kick some butts. B what? But... Rabbit butts? Is, is that it? What, what butts exactly do you expect to be kicking? Okay, Dr. Watts, whatever you say. To the lighthouse we go. I really shouldn't leave that door open. I don't... I, can we close that? Nope. Alright. There are gonna be rabbits all over the house when we get out back here. Never mind, go back. Okay, to the lighthouse we go then. Also, I want to talk to kids more. I cannot, because they are following me. Yeah, the children are following me. It's not creepy at all. There's that pigeon again. I, uh... I don't like the fact that those are everywhere. And also watching me, apparently. Look, it, f it, it follows me. I, I don't... I don't appreciate that. Okay, here's the lighthouse. There it is! We need to head south to the street and take the other path to get down to it now. Yeah, I forgot my parachute. Yeah, you do that all the time, don't you, Tommy? You just jump up with a parachute all the time. I got a feeling you're not supposed to do that either. There's the bird again! It's showing me the way, so I suppose it's a good bird? Either that, or it's a very, very creepy bird. I am decided. Oh, that is not the correct path. Okay, this way. This way? Yeah, this way. Where's the bird? I thought the bird was supposed to show us the way. The way of the bird. South path, right? Right? That, that means we should go... Now it works perfectly fine! Whatever. Oh, it's down by the road where we first got here. Yeah, okay. That branch is not suspicious at all, by the way. It's totally not gonna break very suddenly or something. It's here! Uh... My novelty beach ball! I thought I'd lost it. Oh, it's not a rubber rock. It's a beach ball. That looks very much like a rock. It's stupid anyway. Oh, I'll never lose it again. I'm gonna hide it. Don't look. Uh, we don't have time for the... Okay, done. Right. Now let's just head to the lighthouse. To the lighthouse we go. Squirrels. It's smoking. Who's that dummy that crashed the... Oh, it's him. Who's that dummy that crashed the car? Who do you think? That was, uh, Dr. Rosalie. Yeah. Of course it was. Of course it was, Dr. Watts. Oh, Dr. Watts. Tss, tss, tss. Really? Watts, you're gonna blip? I don't know why I'm surprised, to be honest. He always does this. You always do this, what? Why, what? Also naming a scientist, what? I get it. That, uh, that's a sleeping thing. Ooh, a squirrel. Excuse me, gotta let out the cat. Bye, cat. Ooh, a squirrel! You can't speak. You're like me! I don't... I don't think... I don't think we should wake this up. There's... Oh, shit! <laughs> There's battle? <laughs> don't worry, kids. I got this! Is this the butts we were supposed to be kicking? Not rabbit butts, but squirrel butts. There's a fine difference. What the hell is this pose? 
<laughs> you're fighting it. You ran it over. You ran a squirrel over, and now you're fighting one. You are crazy, one. <laughs> Tsunami kick, tornado punch. Shoot! I don't see. Uh. I want. I really want to see the tornado punch. Yelling volume. Loudest! The way I always play! This and here! Yeah. Stop it! Or we tell more you animal abuse! Good, Sarah. Good. Yeah, she called the cops on you. Oh, come on! I wasn't actually gonna. Don't you like roleplaying? You're a nerd, Watts. I like you. You should be ashamed of yourself. Damn right you should. Let's name it Daddy. Okay. Let's just go. My whole night is ruined. Yeah, I know. You wanted to play, spend it playing D&D, but... This is the way it's going instead. Yeah, man. Here we go. Some of these scenes are really pretty. The mysterious lighthouse. What could be within its depths? I wonder. Oh, what is this? In memory of River E. Wiles. River Wiles, huh? Was she John's wife? Dear now, you don't know anything, Sarah. Shut up! Okay, that's a little harsh on a kid. Come on, the lighthouse right there. I I know it's right there. Also, that wasn't a voice crack. Shut up. Uh, all right, the lighthouse. Hmm, we have a little bit of more time, so we're gonna see what's right inside. Stairs. What a surprise! In a lighthouse? Never heard of. Walkie, walkie, walkie. And uh, there they are again. This is it. There's a different one over there. Oh, I can walk over them now? Huh. Don't I scrunch, scrunch them up like that? Seems like this thing hasn't been functioning for quite a while now. Oh, that's too bad. A multicolored paper rabbit. Hey, this wasn't here when we came last week. I, uh... I don't like the word of that. that I don't like where this is going. Oh yeah, Yanni must have come here before he fell ill again. Two colors. Hmm. Am I the only one who's a little creeped out by these, though? No, Dr. Watts. I am too. Very much. Get out of here. Yeah, you are. Yep. The children are braver than you, Watts, but that's because they're dumb and don't know any better. You should always fear the rabbit. What the? Someone's calling me. Well, who could it be except Rosaline has been setting up the machine forever now? Ah, I should have guessed. Yeah, yeah, we're coming. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Alright, let's head back. As for this... Why are you picking it up? But sure, I guess it might help with the simulation or something. Oh, I don't have to walk all the way back. I appreciate that. I'd probably just get lost. What did they put on his head? What the cactus were you doing? Again with the random ass things that he just put in instead of swear words. Burning ants with a magnifying glass. Is that the first thing you come to think of about do using moonlight? 
Calling you out on your bullshit, what? Okay, I was taking a nap then. You... are you a compulsive liar? God, it's so hard to be a smart ass nowadays. Well, that's because you're not smart. You're pretty good at being half- Ah, <laughs> Rosaline. You're pretty good at being half of it. An ass. Your helmet's on the cat. Your helmet's on the cat. Get it on. We're going in. However, I'm afraid we're gonna have to wait with that until the next episode. What the hell have they done to his head? Ah, I don't know. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Things are heating up, and I really kind of like the creepy vibe. Uh, so, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, you can like, comment, subscribe, whatever. You know about all that stuff already. Thumbs up, I'm out!